Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at five of the best double action, single action, all metal frame, full size handguns in today's market. I couldn't wait to get this thing going and we're doing it today. And let's start right here with the Beretta 92X Performance. I absolutely love this handgun. I think when they came out with this in 2019, they created a winner built for competition, much like the M9 models, except it has a stainless steel frame. Adding to weight, it also has front serrations, ambidextrous thumb safety, frame mounted thumb safety, and an amazing trigger. Let's get into it. Comes with two 15 round magazines. The larger M9 mags will work with this handgun. A vertex style grip, a little more vertical, a little thinner. I brought this out. It also comes with a rubber grip if you want a little wider, maybe a little more textured, but I'm totally fine with this. Love the back strap and front strap texturing. Feels great in the hand. 4.9 inch barrel. Breda calls these sawtooth serrations. All right, a little bit different, very thin. Does have a rail right there. Fully adjustable sights and a fiber optic front sight. What an amazing pistol this is. Extremely accurate with the Brigadier slide where the barrel is exposed and a single action trigger that is four pounds with the reset right here for the follow-up shots. Double action is extremely smooth as well. The entire package is incredible. MSRP, $14.99. And I have to tell you, it is worth every penny of that price. Here we have a Tanfolio Defiant Stock Master. I love this handgun right out of the case. It was so accurate. Way better shooter than I could ever imagine to be. But I put that front sight on the target and pulled the trigger and was ringing steel all day long. It was so much fun. And it has been since I've owned it. Imported by the Italian Firearms Group. This is not a witness. This is part of the Defiant series. They make this in 9, 40, 45, 10 millimeter. This is a 9 millimeter model with 17 round mags very nice texturing in the back strap and the front a wood grain looking polymer grip feels great in the hand with the extended beaver tail you can see it does have a skeletonized hammer right there ambidextrous thumb safety okay both sides and a trigger that i am measuring the single action right at four pounds with a reset right here very nice double action pull as well. If you look at those memory bumps for the rear serrations, they're a little bit different, but it certainly works when charging the pistol. Does have a rail right there, beefy forehand on the dust cover. Lightning cuts in the slide, cycles the action nice and quick, and a fiber optic front sight. Love this pistol. Together, the package is just amazing. Goes a little over 1100 bucks, so a little less expensive than some of the other models featured in this video. Now, this is not a witness. This is the Defiant series, imported by the Italian Firearms Group. And what they did with the Stock Master was to take the Stock 3 frame and the Stock 2 features, put it together, and come up with the Defiant Stock Master. People told me throughout the years, you have to check out Tanfolio. Shooters love them on the competition market, and now I know why this gun is a premier pistol. Many shooters love CZ handguns, and one of their favorites is the Shadow 2. It's a beautiful looking and all around functioning pistol. This is called the black and blue model. Okay, blue aluminum grips there, nice texturing. The back strap, very nice, as well as the front strap. Feels great in the hand, very well balanced with an all steel frame. 17 round magazines. And you can see it does have an undercut in the trigger guard and adjustable magazine release. 
You can see it sticks out a bit. That is adjustable. I like it the way it is. Extended beaver tail there. Skeletonized hammer. And a trigger that I am measuring in single action. Three and a quarter pounds with a reset. Right there. People love that. The double action is very nice too. Right around seven and a half or eight pounds. It has a rail. A, a beefy fore end on the dust cover, front serrations. The rear sights they are calling Hajo, and it is height only adjustable sights, as well as a fiber optic front sight. Together, the package is amazing. The entire thing, what they did with this is, is just great. People love it. At the range, it performs incredibly well. I cannot speak highly enough of the CZ Shadow 2. You know, it, for, for those who compete or those who want one of the most accurate pistols out there, the Shadow 2 is often their choice. It fits the bill very nicely. It does have an ambidextrous thumb safety, all right, frame mounted on both sides and a beautiful looking gun. It's loaded weight with 18 rounds is 54 ounces. So it has some weight behind it but it certainly tames any recoil the 9mm will offer. It's a all-around package that people love. It's beautiful. It works great. And the CZ Shadow 2, extremely popular and for good reason. When A-Rex Arms came out with the Rex-01, a lot of people took notice, but not long after that, they came out with the A-Rex Alpha, and here it is. Full size, all steel frame, five inch barrel, nine millimeter pistol that was built for competition. Comes with three 17 round mags, 20 round mags are available, and they do share mags with the A-Rex-01. Ambidextrous magazine release and thumb safety, making it left-handed friendly a polymer grip here with front checkering built right into the steel full 1913 pick rail an angled cut there gives it a little different look to it and also on top there there are lightning cuts and if you notice the top of the slide and the barrel is cut to give it the same look all the way through a little bit different kind of cool serrated black rear sights Fully adjustable and a fiber optic front sight. Front serrations as well. And the single action trigger is extremely light. I'm measuring it at three and a half pounds with a reset for the follow-up shots. Pretty short. Skeletonized hammer there. A nice handgun. You know, when I took it to the range, guns like this instill confidence. And that's how I felt with the A-Rex Alpha. They're known for longevity. You know, the A-Rex Arm says that their guns run forever. I have no reason to doubt that. This is a sharp shooting handgun. It's a good looking handgun. I think it is. I, I think it's a good looking handgun. A little bit different than the others featured in this video, but purchased for under a grand. That's a big time bonus. And I certainly appreciate what they did with the Alpha. If you're looking for a full size steel frame handgun that won't break the bank, the Alpha would make a great choice. Here we have the smallest and lightest pistol of the group, and it is the undeniable Sig Sauer P226. This pistol has been around for years now, and it has stood the test of time. Whether it's for duty, home defense, competition, target shooting, the P226 has been getting it done for years. And I love this one. This is a Talo exclusive model. It goes about $1,100 if you could find one. Check out those rosewood grips. They are really sharp looking. Diamond checkering, Sig medallion, 4.4 inch barrel. It is an alloy stainless elite with a PVD alloy aluminum frame. Keeps the weight down a bit, 39 ounces loaded. Comes with 15 round mags. Here's a 18 round Metgar mag, but 15 rounders have the flat base plate right there. 
Very nice checkering in the front strap. You can see it does have a full pick rail right there. Front serrations. Sig Light night sights. Three dot. And it's an SRT. Trigger short. Reset trigger. Right around four pounds in the single action. But check out this reset. Very short. Amongst the lightest that you'll ever find is right here with the Sig Sauer SRT trigger. I've had it for five years now. It has been great. I can't remember any malfunctions with a variety of ammo. It's an accurate shooter. It's a sharp looking gun. It's extremely reliable and I I can't speak enough about it. You know people say that this is among the best nine millimeter pistols ever created. Double action, single action is just an amazing platform. And SIG has created several variations of the P226. I like this Taylor exclusive. It's mine, a bit biased, but I certainly appreciate every SIG Sauer P226 model ever created. Those are my choices for the best full-size double action, single action, all metal frame handguns. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you think I missed and what you feel are the best full-size double action single action metal frame handguns if you like videos like this please subscribe and share i always appreciate thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe